Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, thanks for stopping by. I'm Jaya, but you can call me Holly J. And as you can tell by the title, and I'm in mean the wheel, I'm about to go try these Duncan Fall drinks. I asked my Instagram, should I do Starbucks or should I do Duncan? And everyone chose Duncan. So if this video does pretty well and you guys like it, I'll do Starbucks next. But I'm such a big fall lover. I already got my pumpkin. Like, I'm ready to paint my pumpkins and get my house all holidified. So I'm super hyped and, you know, just, just just obsessing a little bit about fall being on the way so i'm gonna head to duncan and i'm gonna go try out their new drinks i don't know if i'm gonna try the treats or anything probably not but i do want to see like what the drink's talking about and like give my little review on whether i like them or not because here's the thing i honestly love fall love everything fall but i hate like fall scents like pumpkin and apple cider and like i that's not my jam so if you're interested in seeing that keep watching by the way i don't know if anyone's noticed yet on my channel but like my lips are crooked look that side's higher than this side like my lip folds in and it's not symmetrical like my cubis bow is not in the middle of my face y'all it's the weirdest thing ever but it's genetic my mom has it my grand my nana has it like it's the craziest thing ever so when i'm recording i sometimes be looking at my lips like dang my lips are crooked but maybe people don't notice it but now that i pointed out you probably will so fun fact my lips are crooked so i have already searched up for the 2020 um duncan release so i know what they're offering so i know what to order so it's like the new signature pumpkin spice latte new chai latte and pumpkin flavors coffee like it's all pumpkin and i'm freaking out but hopefully it like surprisingly uh makes me happy or something i don't know what, what was that in the hot coffee with the pumpkin uh, swirl in it did you want um the oat milk with it as well yes please and did you want sugar yes please so i have the small ice signature latte pumpkin spice with oat milk the one small hot coffee with two pumpkin swirls oat milk and two sugars Yes, and then isn't there one more drink? Is that three in total? Um, let me double check. So I'm just being told that the main one that we have is the spice. Okay. So the chai latte is isn't isn't there? Yeah, the um, it said it was a new one. Like it's, yeah. it's, yeah, it's, it's right here on that picture too, mm -hmm. for the with the cinnamon. I, I saw it okay. The, uh, yeah. So yeah, just the all like one of each, of, and it should be three. So you got the other two right. I just like to add the yeah. chai latte, please. And then adding a hotter ice. The ice. You got it. Is that all for you? Yes, ma'am. Thank you. It's gonna be 1080s. Okay. to get a little snarky with me. I'm like, sis, I'm just trying to help you out because you don't know what's on me, okay? okay? So yeah, Duncan has three new drinks and I'm getting one of each. Two cold, one hot. I like cold coffee. I like iced coffee. But, um, you know, I'm gonna switch it up on one of them.
Thank you. I'm excited! Even though I hate pumpkin! <laughs> I need to sign up for Dunkin' Coffee Rewards. Cause this is my gym. Dunkin' Coffee is top tier. Let me like, let me like your better, baby. She making my coffee with love, I see you. I think he got that carrier for me. Thank you. Thanks. Okay. I got my drink. Let's go. So now I'm going to look for a place to park so we can try these drinks together. Somewhere where y'all can see me though. Like I need some good lighting. Right here seems good. Okay. What is going on? Why are you carrying on like that? Why is you carrying on like that? Okay, so let's Let's, let me list off what I got. So I got the Signature Pumpkin Spice Latte. I think that's this one. It's really pretty. Look at it. Ooh, and it has, it has whipped cream and cinnamon toppings. Mm. So the Signature Pumpkin, the Signature Pumpkin Spice Latte um, has Pumpkin and vanilla flavors topped with whipped cream, a caramel drizzle, and cinnamon sugar topping. So that's the one I'm gonna try first. They only gave me two straws, but I guess, oh well, that makes sense. Only got two cold drinks. So, oh shoot. Oh, I should take a picture first. Yeah, I'm gonna take a picture first. My nails aren't done though. Ew. Oh gosh, no. I I hate taking pictures with my nails not done. It's so ugly. Maybe I do like a selfie one. Maybe that'll be cute. Oh, it's my fingers for me. Oh, I'm about to taste it. <laughs> I need a thumbnail, so I definitely need to like take me a thumbnail. I'm going in. Wish me luck. Who the flavors just jumped out. The, the flavors just jumped out first, first and foremost. the cinnamon than anything and I'm not I'm not against cinnamon like I like cinnamon I could get with this I could get with this it's not bad it's not bad at all the first sip oh my gosh like the flavors like just bombarded my tongue I think it was cuz like I got like a lot of whipped cream and just like that initial taste was like whoa Yeah, it's that whipped cream. The whipped cream gives you the flavors. Woo. 
it's very pungent but it the, the it needs it because um without that cream it's very coffee like i'm not getting a lot of like flavor without the whipped cream on top you know like if the I'm not getting I'm not getting much pumpkin esque anything from that. Like I'm just getting like a lot of cinnamon, a lot of coffee. Yeah. Next up. Oh gosh. The next one is just the chai the new chai latte. Duncan's fall celebration includes a terrific new option for tea lovers. Offering a sweetened chai tea blend with spices including cinnamon, cardamom, nutmeg, and milk. So, you know, just your like, your regular chai latte, but fall. This one doesn't have any pumpkin in it. Like, I'm actually really disappointed in that because where's the pumpkin? I'm gonna drink it some more, but I, I I only taste cinnamon in that and coffee. So here's the new chai latte. Okay, yeah. I don't like this. Uh, 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 uh. No, no. I could drink it if I had to, but it's lacking. It's lacking. But you know, it's chai tea, so chai tea isn't the sweetest thing. It's not supposed to be that sweet, but it's it's missing some sweetness. Like I can taste the cinnamon, I taste the nutmeg, like I taste all of that. So if you're a chai lover, you'll enjoy this because you'll get those hints of the fall flavors, like the cinnamon and the nutmeg. Like it'll like your senses will get that whole vibe that it's fall. So, I guess for what it's supposed to be, it does the job. Yeah, like it does it, but to me, but it's still, I still, when I taste it, I hate to say this and I don't wanna just like discuss y'all, but it kinda like gives me like dishwater vibes. Like, I like the aftertaste more than the initial sip. Yeah, that initial sip is weird. But then, like, as it sits on my tongue, I'm like, I could drink it, but it's not the tastiest thing. No. So, number three, number three is, they just said, like, pumpkin-flavored coffee. So, the classic cup for fueling up in fall, Duncan's Pumpkin Flavor Swirl is available in its hot or iced coffee. Apparently, they offer it in the chai latte, cold brew, espresso drinks, frozen coffee, and frozen chocolate. Whatever that means. But anyways, pumpkin flavored coffee. So, I got this in the hot version because I didn't want to just do all cold drinks. And maybe cold and like ice drinks don't pick up the pumpkin flavor as much, which is probably why that iced latte isn't really giving me pumpkin vibes i'm scared i don't want to burn my tongue the lid off okay i'm doing it that one I don't know about that one and I'm making an absolute mess and guess what I have on white pants what told me to wear white pants when you about to go try coffee out I don't have no napkins in here you can tell she don't have kids no more she don't even keep no napkins in her car how mamas they like to be prepared because they kids can surprise them at any moment with anything you can tell she don't have kids no more. Okay, I'm gonna give this one one more try. Cause it's 
because it's actually not that hot, so I can just drink it from the the top. Leave the top on it. See, like I'm having a hard time because I'm not tasting the pumpkin. And these last two, I'm kind of like torn if whether it's the, is it the coffee? That's just nasty. Like, I don't know. I don't know. So, I'm thinking to get a second opinion. I think I'm going to have my mom try these ones too and let her tell me what she thinks. But this one definitely won the one with the whipped cream on it the pumpkin spice latte it gave me the most fall vibes it gave me the most like festive drink um from beginning to end but even this one like it tastes just like coffee like that barista just kind of like overpowered everything with the coffee like this is the only one that's giving me like cinnamon and fall festive vibes this chai is it's really not that bad it's not that bad this nah it, it tastes like bad coffee it just tastes like bad coffee like watery coffee like ugh, no and i'm actually really disappointed because duncan i chose i told y'all duncan is top tier for coffee and that was a disappointment if i had to rate each one um i would say Say I'd give this pumpkin spice latte like a seven and a half but I give it a seven and a half too because I don't taste pumpkin I don't taste it and I would expect myself not to like it if it had more pumpkin in it the chai like these taste cool like these back-to-back -back taste good like as I sip this and I sip this I like it I like it but who wants to have to buy two coffees to enjoy this pumpkin festive drink like no one but those two together but as far as the chai latte i would get the chai latte i initially i was gonna say like a five because the flavor at the end that like lingers on your tongue is good but the initial sip tasted like dishwater to me um initially but as i keep drinking the latte the pumpkin spice latte and then the chai it's making it better but y'all saw my initial reaction i'd say five out of ten this pumpkin flavored coffee is a no like i don't know if she just wasn't the right person to make it and i will say that disclaimer you know baristas are different from every location every day maybe she's not having the best day you just never know so we're gonna take those into consideration, but in my experience, the pumpkin spice latte gets a seven and a half, the chai latte gets a five, and this pumpkin flavor coffee is just disgusting. Let's see what my mom thinks. Okay, so got my mama, mama me. Mom's gonna try them. Let's see what she thinks. Mm. Try whichever one you want first. This one's a chai. Oh, chai. chai. This is the one that you kind of make. Yeah, I used to I used to do a chai thing, but I also make my own pumpkin one too. No, I make my own latte. Oh, latte. But that's a chai latte, which is that tea. Yeah. Tea thing. Yeah, so this is supposed to be. Thing. Yeah. It's got the chai going on. <laughs> <laughs> For sure, right? This is the pumpkin spice. It had like whipped cream on the top with cinnamon and. Oh, mm -hmm. it's mm -hmm. definitely fall like. Oh yeah. You like? <laughs> yeah, this is like a dessert. This is like okay after dinner. I'm gonna go get me one of these. One of these. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty filling, kind of flavorful. Mm -hmm. Or you could just eat this for dinner. For for dinner. <laughs> This is a small too. That's a small. Okay, and then oh, this is though. pumpkin flavored coffee. Mm -hmm. Coffee. Yeah. 
just hot warm coffee. Yeah, I got I got that one. Before. Okay. No, maybe I should have started with this with one. With this one. See, I was saying the same thing. Like, I like one, it maybe made me like it better because I was drinking the other ones. Cause I could get with this too. You could get with I that. I could get with this because I'm a coffee. Drink. That was disgusting to me. To you? <laughs> yes. It See, like bad get, coffee to me. Get, I could get with it. This is Do you taste the pumpkin though? Mm -hmm. I don't taste the pumpkin. Mm -hmm. It's a little, it's a little, um, not as strong, you know yeah, what I'm saying? It's I, like all they I taste is coffee, yeah, like, I feel, but I feel like that with all of them. I feel like there wasn't enough pumpkin in everything. Uh -huh. Like, whatever it was supposed to be. Like, even this one, did you taste the pumpkin? I taste the cinnamon. I taste the cinnamon, too. But, but it had a little bit more, you know. More going on, yeah. 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 And then the chai yeah. is like, I'm like, I could, I could drink it, but it's a little too unsweet for me. Oh. Yeah, you Just want it to be like, yeah, yeah. So that was a winner for you? Yeah, but even this, okay, but what would you give them out of 10? Like, so, um, probably an eight. Eight for the pumpkin seven, spice six. latte. Seven, seven for the, six. okay. Yeah. Similar to mine, I was seven and a half. Okay. Five. Okay, you didn't like the chai at all. I mean, it wasn't that. It was like when I first sipped it, it's like I was even before it got iced down. Yes, like, like when I was sipping it, mm -hmm. I liked the taste that it left on my tongue, but I didn't like what I taste when I sip oh, it. Oh, okay, okay. It kind of to me it tasted like dishwater. It's it's very. It's not. You know what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. You don't have enough of the flavor. Of the flavor. Yeah. yeah. Well, there you have it. There you have it. <laughs> so go to Duncan. Try for yourself, and if you like this video, comment down below and um, tell me if you want me to do a Starbucks one. Bye! Bye.